today, it's Texas Tech and NC State. And now, KMAX Stan Smith and Mason Horodisky break down the game before the game. This is KMAC Red Raider Nation's Countdown to Kickoff. Welcome into Red Raider Nation's Countdown to Kickoff, where Texas Tech hits the road for the first time this season against NC State. Mason Horodisky will join us from Raleigh in just a moment. David Collier is standing by, but first, they have been dubbed the preseason darlings of the ACC. We discussed how the Wolfpack and the Red Raiders may not be so different. Also ahead, Mason brings us an update from the East Coast. He tells us the relationship between the two head coaches in this ballgame. And then later, David sits down with longtime Red Raider assistant coach Ruffin McNeil. He reflects on his time in Lubbock. Well, it's the first road game under head coach Joey McGuire, and it's quite the tall order as the Red Raiders are set to take on the 16th ranked Wolfpack of North Carolina State. Now, the last time these two teams met, Phillip Rivers was the starting quarterback for NC State. If that tells you anything about how long it's been, this is a team that has been on the rise over the last several years. They upset Clemson a season ago and are now dubbed a contender to win the ACC. Coach McGuire says North Carolina State is the perfect measuring stick to see where his team is at in the early goings of this season. You know, they kind of have a chip on their shoulder. I mean, if you go back to last year, what happened to them in the bowl game was ridiculous. I mean, it was – that's that should not happen. And I, that, that was bad on the other team's part that even got to that. And so it's going to be fun, man. I'm, I'm excited. Everything that I hear, I've never been, I've never played in that environment. But everything I hear from anybody that has, it's an electric environment. It's going to be a great road test. They're a ranked team. And uh, we're, we're really excited to put a good week together and get on a plane and go play uh, some football against a really good football team and us continue to grow as a program. Now, despite never coaching in Raleigh, Joey McGuire does have a history with NC State head ball coach Dave Doran that actually goes back before McGuire was a college coach. To tell us more, here's Red Raider Nation's Mason Horodisky. Hey guys, welcome to Carter Finley Stadium here in Raleigh, North Carolina, getting ready for the Texas Tech Red Raiders taking on the NC State Wolfpack tonight. Now, these schools haven't played since 2003, but even if that's the case, they're not exactly unfamiliar with each other either. Just ask head coaches Joey McGuire and Dave Doran. Getting to play one of my favorite people in the world. Dave Dorn and I go back a long ways. He actually has a huge fingerprint on Cedar Hill. Um, he was the he was at Kansas in 2003, and he was the first guy to offer one of my guys whenever I was a head coach. We got to know Joey very well, and then he became a state championship coach there and then moved his way up in the profession. He's done a great job as a college coach. I was excited to see him get to be a head coach at Tech. And um, I remember eating pregame meal with this team. He had the best chicken fried steak and gravy you've ever had. I don't know if it's chicken fried steak, but we'll see what Joey's cooking up soon enough. And we'll check in with Mason again later. But now we better call Collier. We'll bring him in right now. Now, David, Texas Tech's last non-conference road win against a Power 5 school came seven years ago, if I'm doing my math right, in 2015 mm -hmm. against Arkansas. To get a win in Carter-Finley Stadium, it will be blank for Texas Tech. Uh, let, let's go with a big word. We're going to go with laborious. How about that? Laborious, right? <laughs> yeah, I know, I, I, I know exactly, right? The Wolfpack I haven't lost at home since November of 2020. Stan, 11 straight wins, which is the fifth best active home winning streak in the FBS. So now another word for laborious is probably the word that I should have gone with is tough. <laughs> Remember, McGuire says they are the toughest, hardest working, most competitive team in the country. So maybe that worked out for him later today. I hope so. I hope you all have a dictionary or a thesaurus <laughs> handy for you as well. We we'll get ready for the SAT. Well, we're going to take a quick break. But coming up next on Countdown to Kickoff, Collier sits down with Ruffin McNeil, who is set to take on his old team from the early 2000s. But after this break, Jordan Kramer from our sister station in Raleigh will help us break down the Wolfpack and what she has seen so far from Coach Doran's group this year.